Technology and cybersecurity are of crucial importance in this COVID era. One of the most exciting transformations caused by the pandemic has been our transition to the digitization of our world, in particular, the utilities network. Technology has been central to the way we have collectively managed the COVID-19 crisis. It allows us to operate pump stations, power stations, trucks, water, and gas supply remotely. It has been the key to our infrastructure, which has made possible the delivery of essential services, the continuation of business, and maintenance of assets even in the most disruptive moments of the pandemic. From the adoption of remote alarm monitoring to the use of SCADA systems, the Internet of Things, Wi-Fi, radio, cellular and satellite communications. In a short period of time, our reliance on the digitalized operation has exponentially increased due to the unprecedented connectivity which we are fast establishing. Utility companies achieve such advancements in digital transformation to the operation technology. However, a SCADA system failure can cause widespread damages. Although the severity of the damage is determined by the level of failure, the livelihood of local communities will be more or less affected, depending on the specific industry or sector in which the system has failed. A catastrophic failure can bring a complete halt to the power supply, transportation, water and gas services of local communities. COVID-19 crisis would be seen in this respect as a small disturbance in comparison to a major utility network failure. The cyber attack on Colonial Pipeline in 2021 and Optus in 2022 marks a fundamental inflection point in our global course of digitalization in operation technology. While it is still early to ascertain the future impact of attacks, it is already visible that it is a catalyzing effect that exposes the inconsistencies and inadequacies of multiple systems, including industrial communication systems, to a certain extent, operational technology networks, hardware, software, employee experience, and management mindsets. It has shed light to organizational shortcomings that have never been properly addressed before, which impedes forward thinking, innovative solutions, and community oriented vision. An existing fragmented operation technology network architecture is not fit anymore for purpose in the 21st century. It is high time for an in-depth audit change is not happening, we have a choice to stay reactive, old school engineering, repetitive design and cookie cutter approaches. If we do not stop this mindset, it will lead to a less secure, less efficient and much more fragile utilities industry. On the other hand, we can instead use our technology to reevaluate our utility and build a new defensive SCADA network. We recommend an operation technology every critical infrastructure to shape a much more resilient system for local communities. Firstly, we encourage them to be creative and fanatic about protecting our clients and communities, foster personal growth, creating great engineers. Secondly, we advocate to open markets to large utility companies for their consideration for inspecting their SCADA networks. Finally, we utilize our technology to check and defend operation technology networks. Operational technologies are vulnerable to a wide range of security threats. Organizations must implement security measures at their network and device level. Security best practices and standards and raise user awareness and education to ensure the protection of the industrial control systems and the industrial internet. It is crucial for organizations to keep vigil with the latest security threats and apply the necessary design and implementation to mitigate. Australian Control Engineering is specialized in operational technology networks, audit, 
design, and implementation for the utility industry. If you would like to learn more about our capability and understand how we can help you protect your assets, please contact us today.